pine needles. Now you have probably heard this thousands of times. Them pine needles gonna kill your grass and it will most definitely raise your soil acidity. I promise you that. The fact of the matter is that when a pine needle falls from the tree, it's usually dead and it's brown and it carries a pH of 3.2 to 3.8. That is not very acidic. But when it hits your soil, you think that the rain is gonna flush the acidity down and harm your lawn. Not the case. There's also some old wives tales that if you take pine needles and you till them into your garden, that that is gonna help acidify the soil also not the case now the fact that these wives tales have been around for so many years and are constantly being regurgitated to people is not helping the situation it does not acidify your soil and that is not killing your grass the pine needles do not kill your grass let me reiterate that they do not kill your grass the only real problem that you're actually going to have with pine needles that might be killing your grass is the fact that you're not cleaning them off just go out and leaf blow. All you're doing is smothering the lawn and that is causing the grass to die. That's why it looks patchy and that's why you're like, oh, it's acidic soil. No, it's not. Just blow them off and stop suffocating your lawn. Also, those big old pine trees that you may have in your yard are not causing the soil to be acidic. The truth is the soil was already acidic before the tree even grew. That's just one thing that you need to keep in mind. That soil is already acidic. The tree did not make it acidic. It grows in acidic soil, but it did not make it acidic. Get your facts right. Well then, how come I got big circular patches of dirt underneath them pine trees? Can you answer that one for me? Well, as a matter of fact, I can. The main reason you have big circular patches of dirt underneath your pine trees is lack of sun. It is a shady area usually covers right down to the ground. That's why it's dirt. Grass cannot grow without sunlight. Even tall fescue, you gotta have some form of sunlight. Does that help? Well, hot damn. I guess now I know. Don't taste so good either. Well, I hope that helps clear up some of your concerns about pine trees and pine needles because those are just old wives tales that's centuries ago. Welcome to 2020. So if you guys did like this video and you enjoyed the content, make sure you leave a like on the video. Maybe subscribe if you're so inclined for more videos like this. I'd greatly appreciate it. And with that, this has been Backwoods. We'll see you in the next one.